Walter. Oh, oh hi. 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 Good morning, right. bud. You're kind of early. It's I like to be. Huh. You know. I see you've got the devotional all ready for us. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, that's appreciate that, buddy. Jesus served, me too. Thank you. You probably read the assignment too. Uh-huh. Three times? Just twice. Okay. Was I supposed to do it three times? No, th twice is fine. Okay. Yeah, thanks. Oh, hey. Ah, bro Harris. Hey, Trayvon. That What's up, man? man? Yeah. Good, good. To good. see you. Good yeah. to be here. Yeah, man. Thanks for being on time. Absolutely. Jacob. How you doing, bud? Hey, you're doing great. Well, Brother Harris. You got your scriptures? Hey. Yep. Yeah, okay. got them right there. Right there. Yeah, of course. All right. What's up, buddy? How are you? Butch. What's going on, man? Good to see Let's you. See, how was the game? <laughs> Went well. Yeah? Looking at your feet, walking to the beat, missing everybody that you couldn't meet. If you stepped outside your own little world, you gotta look up, look up. Yeah, you gotta look up. Hey, welcome to class, everybody. Glad to see you here. Uh, w Walter, you know, he's got our devotional ready, so he's gonna play the piano and lead and and then give our prayer and our message. So we'll turn the time over to Walter. Yeah, I, I was. I had to configure the TCP/IP port for the school. And I, yeah, so. I don't know what you said, but I'm glad you're here, buddy. Sorry, man. Come on in. Have a seat. All right, we're just getting our scriptures out, man. We just had a good devotional. Appreciate that, Walter. Thank you. That that was the best ten minute devotional I've ever heard. All right, scriptures. You got them? Yeah. Hey, Joe. You got scriptures? Down there. Okay. Can you pull your headphones out for me, bud? Thank you. All right, Butch. Randy. Yeah. Several. Okay. Trey. Trayvon. Okay. Good. You got an extra set. Walter got an extra set. Anyone needs it. <laughs> okay. Just in case. All right, guys. Let's open up First Nephi, chapter three. Hey, yeah. What, hey, what are you doing Friday night? Yeah. Yeah. You want to like hang out and go to movies? Oh, hey, oh, oh, wait, oh, wait, my mom's calling. Hey, mom, oh, yeah, I'm on my way to seminary right now. Okay, uh, yeah, like, I had to do something. I was talking to the teacher. Okay, bye. Read verse 7 for us. Sure. And it came to pass that I, Nephi, said unto my father, I will go and do... Go ahead, you're, you're all right? Yeah, yeah, just a second. Not much. Hey, just verse 7 there, Jacob. Oh yeah, yep. Yeah, I'll get there. You okay, everything alright? Yeah, the, the things that the Lord hath commanded. Um, I think this is probably my mom. Stephanie, would you read verse six for us? Stephanie. Oh, uh huh. Verse six. Are you, are you there? Uh, hold on, I just need to send this real quick. Okay. Now what? <laughs> Verse 6. You want to read that? What book are we in? Um, yeah, Book of Mormon. Okay. First Nephi. Hang on, hang on. Let me find it. So Nephi comes across Laban. They're in the street, right? Uh, Joe. Joe? Hey, Joe. Yeah. Hey, buddy, would you read for me? Verse 8 right there. Oh, how? Twilight? Is that good? You enjoying that? That's all I got. I was just... Oh, thanks, man. You got it? All right. That I was constrained by the spirit that I should kill Laban. But I said in my heart, never at any time have I shed the blood of man. Okay, buddy. Yeah, yeah. And I shrunk that I would not play him. And uh, you want me to keep going? You want me to hit verse 11, too? Yeah, that'd be good. Butch, what do you think of that verse, man? Uh, my phone died. Does somebody else have some? Oh, well, I, I got some. Oh, yeah, here. thanks, man. Here. Appreciate uh -huh. it. Thank you, Walter. Oh, yeah. You can find it. What scripture was it? Yeah, it's verse 9. 
chapter four. You're right there. Yeah. yeah. Wrong book, buddy. Book, book of Mormon. Yeah, Book of Mormon. Yeah. Is that good? And it came to pass that when Laman saw me, he was exceedingly frightened. And also Lemuel and Sam. Uh, hey, babe, can I call you back? Yeah, okay. In class, thanks. Bye-bye. For they had fled from my presence. All right, thank you, Jacob, for reading verse 14 there. Uh, let's look at this a little closer. Walter, what are your thoughts? What, what do you think that verse means? Um... Are you with us, bud? Uh, what you doing there? Some, just some math. I got a test today. Yeah. Okay. I understand that. You, you want to maybe look at the verse with us, though? Which one? The robot dance. Randy. Do you want to share some thoughts on that verse, man? Uh, got it open on one of those? Uh, I gotta get this. It's, it's my mom. Your mom. Yeah, you better take it then. Alright, we'll have some. Dude, else. what's up, homie? Um, so I found a quote from President Monson from this last conference where he talks about the Book of Mormon, talks about some blessings from it. Please share that. Uh, he says, as we do so, we will be in a position to hear the voice of the Spirit. I often feel they don't deserve it. Isn't that powerful? Brother Harris, is that alright if I take a picture of this? Oh, you bet. Yeah, go for it. I thought it'd be cool to tweet that out. Looking at Iron Rod, and I looked at the footnote, and uh, it talked about how the Iron Rod was the Word of God. So, Trayvon, that's awesome. Do you know how to click on that and actually add a note in there? Yeah. Let's do that and put down different ways that the Word of God can come to us. Let's add that in our note. Hey, that that verse we just read about condescension, I didn't know what it meant, and I looked it up, and it says that uh, it's like a voluntary descent from one's rank. For me, it's like Christ coming down from heaven, like to help us out. Anyone want to share something that you marked that was meaningful to you? Butch? I noticed like in verse nine, it says the Lord maketh no such thing known unto us, and Lemon and Lemuel say that. But then down in 11, Nephi says the opposite. Surely these things shall be made known unto you. It's like opposite. So I marked them in the same colors. Awesome, thank you, Butch. All right, you've had time to record something that was meaningful from our lesson today as a text. Now I want you to think about someone that you think might need that, and let's send it out to him right now. Oh, hey, it's Jill. Oh, seminary. You guys being here, we're gonna end with a closing prayer. Hey. hey, Brother H! Good to see you, man. What's up, man? Hey, I... Thanks for the text, brother. Oh, man. Oh. Hey. hey, I got the closing prayer. Walter, sit down. It's okay. Let's do this. It's good. And action! You ready? Oh, I had work. <laughs> Brother Harris, I, look. He's not wearing a look. Look. Yeah, what's up, homie? The ringtone kept going.
Stephanie, where were you on Friday? Is this Snapchat picture? Yeah. Like... yeah. Colin first. Yeah, you're Colin. Colin first. Tell him run right now. And then from there, he was, he was doing like some extra stuff. Like after that, I'm like, it's over. It's over. It's done. I'm supposed to be the one that's like, not know what's going on. Yeah, yeah. She commanded them. <laughs> did you guys get any dude, of them? Dude, what's up? <laughs> None. You're supposed to call. Did you? Did you? Call yeah, text. text. No, text. It's a text. Yeah. 801. I, I texted you three times. <laughs> He's texting some random. Oh, I got him now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so you need to start building. <laughs> Walter, sit down. Sit down, Walter. I. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, scene four, whatever. Sniper. Yeah.